So our experiment is called rate splitting multiple access for integrated sensing and communications. Networks will provide communication capabilities, but also sensing capabilities. So we're investigating this because we see that the spectrum is limited. And if the spectrum is limited, we want to understand how we can make use of the spectrum in the most efficient way. My experiment uh, is to build a test bed to test uh, the conventional uh, multiple access techniques we have implemented on our real life to compare to the other new technologies, which is called risk splitting multiple access. And uh, the theoretical study is really rich in risk splitting multiple access. The benefits we are trying to find is the theoretical gain from our theoretical world in the real life. After uh, testing, we can find the gain actually in our test bed from our new techniques. To do the experimental study is to show the feasibility to the industry that our techniques can be implemented on the devices has been already exist in our real life. Rate splitting multiple access is a technique that we have pioneered in the past 10 years here at the Imperial College. We have now identified 40 different use cases where these techniques, rate splitting multiple access, can be used into future 6G. And we have developed the first prototype actually to show the feasibility of these techniques. And this is for unicast transmissions, for multicast transmissions, for multi-group multicast transmissions, for non-orthogonal unicast and multicast transmissions. And the latest one is this demonstration today on integrated sensing and communications.